Rain drops on the kitchen floor And the curtain is blowing where the windows open Your arms wrapped around my neck And the kitchen sink is just overflowing on I came here in 1994 from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania and I never quite felt at home in Pittsburgh and my dad moved up here to Minnesota and I came to visit him and just got off the plane and just felt totally at home. You know that it's true. This the community that I, I found when I came up here with all the other bands was so supportive. You know, I started out at the same time of, as like Atmosphere and The Bad Plus and well, I was Happy Apple at that time. but you know, Dave King and Slug and then Craig Finn from uh, Lifter Puller at that time, and the, but now the Hold Steady. All those guys, we were all sort of coming up at the same time, and, and it was just such a fun environment where, you know, I'd do shows with Slug, or I'd do shows with Dave King, and, and it just, not many cities have that kind of eclectic mix of music happening at once. Like, I remember doing at the Red Sea, it was a show, Dave King played drums for the first hour and a half, and then I played guitar and sang for the next hour and a half. That was like a, a bill, like one of the average bills we would we would do starting out. And you know that it's true. I wrote the song Raindrops on the Kitchen Floor last spring. It was it's a good example of you know coming through a hard winter and then I was in my studio out west of the cities and it just was like a happy sunny day and it was one of the first days of spring and I just sat down and it kind of wrote itself. I wrote it on piano and it was just just such a happy song for me and a lot of times if I write that kind of happy song I'll feel like, oh, is this too happy? It should, you know, maybe I should try to add some darkness to it and the longer I've done this, you know, craft of, craft of songwriting, I, I just try to leave it alone more and more and realize that some of my favorite songs I've written are the ones that come the fastest, that it's the ones where I get out of the way and just let the gesture be a gesture and not try to complicate it with too many, you know, edits or thinking too hard about it. So that was one that I just kind of left alone and let be happy. And you know that it's true. Minnesota Original is made possible by the State Arts and Cultural Heritage Fund and the Citizens of Minnesota.